like me uh, about as much as ramen? Ramen? Are you serious? Yuko jumps out from behind the door. Whoa, what the? You've got some nerve, Kenji. Huh? What the hell are you telling her? I'm gonna go... I'm going to smack that goofy look off your face. Uh, I, I've got some business to take care of, ladies. Uh, I mean, ladies? Not ladies, like... Okay, yeah, ladies, ladies. Seriously, that moron. You guys... You were listening? Sorry, we were all worried about you. Try and cheer up. But sheesh, what the hell was that idiot thinking? Comparing you to something like a bowl of noodles. No, you don't get it. Ramen is his favorite thing in the world. No kidding. If he likes me as much as he likes ramen, I'll be happy. Jeez, you dope. Huh? Why do you look like you're about to cry, Yuko? I don't know. Jeez. Chiaki. Thanks for giving me that extra push I needed. She's just like, ha 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 ha! Why is she laughing? Random laughter. Well, why don't we call today's practice over and go to walk? Sounds like a plan. Tell you what, Ryo, I'm buying you a milkshake. <laughs> awesome! Hooray! Friendships. Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Do you think the lost will ever be cured? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, maybe if we defeat a shadow, the spirits at aid will return to their owners. But then again, they might just get digested. What? Extra fish? Thanks for giving me that extra fish. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oh no, I should have gone out. Oh, oh I forgot about the new social link. Good morning, this is Theodore. I have business with you, so please come to the Velvet Room at your earliest convenience. It is an important matter that involves you. I will be waiting. Okay. The Kirijo Company was in the news again yesterday. Kirijo? The student council president? You know, the Kirijo Company built this whole school. I wonder how a company that big was contracted to build a school. School, school, school. I guess what else? School. Who is it? Oh, Chiaki-chan. It's a coincidence meeting you here. Oh yeah, are you free today after school? I don't know yet. I'll decide, Fuka, but I'm most likely free. Really? What happened there? rough life. Oh. Eh. Please forgive me for calling you like this. There's something I must bring to your attention. There's been... There seems to be someone inside Tartarus between floors 44 and 47. It seems to be someone without the potential who heard the voices of the shadows. If left alone, they will become lost in your world and may die. Please find them and return them. 44 and 47? I'll try and remember that, but... Oh! I can go on a date with Theo? Hang on. That doesn't take up any time, so I might as well. Thank you very much. Well then, please lead the way. I think these are all voice, too, so that's good. Theo doesn't seem to want to get on the escalator. These stairs. They're moving. Uh, I've heard of this. It's called an escalator, no? Digimon World Redigitized. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't have any problem writing sorry. something like this. My nose is still stuffy. Should I? I'm sorry. Okay. 
Okay, sorry. Despite Theo's words, he isn't budging from where he stands. It seems he can't grasp the timing of it. Escort Theo. I, I can't allow you to do that. I'll go on ahead. Please, allow Aww. me. He's blushing. Theo took your hand and finally decided to get on the escalator. Oh, is there one on my oh. menu? This is rather slow. You both got off safely. Oh, oh why is he blushing? Ah, child's play. <laughs> You're a dork. Theo seems proud for some reason. So, this is a strip Oh, this mall. part. A lively place indeed. Mmm, this smell. No, no, don't tell me. Whoa! You can figure out our secret ingredient just by its smell? Whoa! <laughs> How about it? You want to buy one? It'll make you smile so wide your cheeks will fall off. So good as to make one's cheeks fall off? It's true, that's takoyaki. That would be dire indeed. Want to try it out? I don't think you're taking my will as seriously as you should. Well then, I accept your challenge. Ninety-seven degrees Fahrenheit, and this texture. There's no mistaking it. Mm. All right, out with it. There are things your kind is better off not knowing. So I've been taught, which means I mustn't. Now I want takoyaki, it's so good. But using that for cooking, it's apparent now why one's cheeks might fall I off. I need it. <laughs> Theo's pinching his cheeks. <sighs> he pinched your cheeks as well for some reason. Yours seem to be in no danger. He's so cute. Thank goodness. Thanks? Well, if anything were to happen to you... Yes? You are, after all, a valued guest. It's true. That hurt, didn't it? I'm so sorry. Oh, one sec, guys. I gotta... It's okay, it's a quick slip up of Hiragana there. That's okay, Jonah. I still want takoyaki. It's so good. Well now, isn't this charming? Would this be considered a souvenir of my time with you? How unfortunate. I've acquired something precious to me. It's your fault, you realize. That's why I won't let you have this. 
thank you for showing me such a delightful time today. The flow of time is fixed at a certain speed, and yet it seems there are moments when it passes so quickly. Oh, that car's... You mustn't allow yourself to become so lost in thought. Now, let us go. Oh my god, Chow Garden. I miss the Chow Garden. Thank you for showing me around Iwatorai Station. That machine you called an escalator. It was very interesting. I immediately asked to have one placed in the Velvet Room. But again, my master refused immediately. It's quite unfortunate, I feel. Still, I was able to experience a new and fascinating taste of your cuisine today. This is a significant day. In order to keep that memory in my mind, I want to recreate the dish we shared. However, I'm having difficulty in determining how to implement that near-octopus flavor. Ah, oh, excuse me. Pay no attention to what I just said. Now, as for a reward, I've prepared something special. What do I get? I can fuse Empusa or Empusa? Ah. Hey! You know what's sad, though? You know how they wanted to turn the Velvet Room into... A dance club. They've totally done that in Dancing All Night. So it's kind of sad, but it's also like, hey, Elizabeth, guess what? Ah, uh, no, not blind. Hello, by the way, but yeah, not blind. Uh, oh. Um, was it Fuka that wanted to hang out today? Oops. Jen, have you decided what to make today? If you haven't, then would you like to make this for with the baby? Look on this page, chocolate truffles. Don't they look good? Since Fuka has brought the ingredients for them, you decide to try making chocolate truffles. Um, one teaspoon of liqueur. That doesn't seem like enough. Dissolve 200 grams of milk chocolate in hot water. Am I supposed to put hot water in it, or it into the water? Do you need any help? Oh no, it's okay. I should be able to do this. Thanks, though. Yay, I got truffles. If you give them to someone when you go out on your days off, it might make them happy. Yes, I'm done! This is much this is much more fun when there's two people here. Thanks, Chiaki chan. Fuka's laughing as if she's truly having fun. Yay for Fuka. How does this look? It's a little odd shaped. There's an apple-sized dark substance on the plate Fuka handed you. This is big. Say that bigger is better, so a sour smell wafts, 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 wah, wah, from the so-called truffle. I 
thought that a teaspoon of liqueur wasn't enough, so I used a cup of it. Oh my god. Look, see? Fuka's proudly holding up a bottle labeled vinegar. Because this recipe is so obviously inedible, you decide to point this out to Fuka. Huh? Oh, you're right. It says rice vinegar. I didn't notice at all. I'm hopeless, aren't I? I just want to help everyone, even outside of battle. So I thought that they might like having some homemade food or sweets when they're tired. And when they're tired, not tied. Whoa, where, what? But I want to try harder so that I can get better at this. Plus, now that you're helping me out, I want to succeed even more. I'll try harder next time. Aw. Cute. Where have you been? I've been looking for you. I have some unfortunate news regarding your investment. Things are not running as smoothly as planned. It still has the potential to turn a profit, but I would require an additional 10,000 yen to get things back on track. So he's basically swindling you out of $300. Are you willing to increase your investment by this amount? I'll be in touch once your fortune has been made. What for? Huh? What? Wait, did I say something? Did I ask a question about something? Now I'm kind of confused. Oh, I might have to. Okay, sorry, one sec, guys. I gotta. Deal with stuff for work for a sec. I, I shouldn't take too long. Just a couple minutes. Sorry.
Hi! Oh, whoa! There's a Monokuma. Sorry, I'm back. I was going to buy a book on phobias, but I was afraid it wouldn't help me. Oh! Oh no! Strawberry cream cheese? I've had strawberry cream cheese. Why? Where's my controller? There's my controller. <laughs> There's a monokuma. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, thanks, Neo. Aki? You're not Aki. Aki, why do you do this to me? Um, is Rios almost done? Oh, mm, kind of. Okay, let's hang out with Rio for now. And then maybe on, on Monday I'll hang out with Aki. You sweated it out with the other club members. <laughs> okay, I'm going to start tossing balls. Ko would love you. <laughs> Hit them back and aim as close as you can to the inside of the lines. You get 10 tries, then you move to the back of the line. The rest of you, practice your swings while you wait. Rio's made such a sudden comeback. We should call her a phoenix. Phoenix Rio. Why not just call her Renix? Fiwasaki sounds good too. Though it does sound kind of like some kind of monster. Hey, if you don't stop flapping your jaws, my next serve is going to go straight for your face. Ooh, bring it on. I'll smack it right back at you. Everyone's talking now more than before, but they're all enjoying the practice. I guess in the end, I realized that Rio's just a teenage girl like us. Maybe we should ask her if she wants to join us on a group date when it isn't during practice. I want to go too. You've got someone already, don't you? I've heard the rumors too, so why not tell us more? Hey, you three, shut it before I make you two more squats. There's rumors about me and Aki? Assuming they mean Aki and not Junpei. I think it helped to pair up people who have the same weaknesses today. I never would have had that idea myself. Someone else recommended it to me. I really think everyone's committed to the team now. Well, no, I know they were all committed to each other the whole time. I guess I only just now saw what we were missing. I didn't take the time to see who excelled in what. Chiaki, from the looks of it, you're good at bringing a team together. You've really got an eye for details. Seriously, you're a much better leader than I am. Thanks. Let's keep doing our best. Chihiko. <laughs> but notice the name Aki is in Chiaki. I'm gonna go, Ryo. I'm proud of you. Chiaki. Why Akiaki? Let's clean up fast and go home. Oh, I know. Let's stop by Wok. How many times are we gonna eat at Wok? Wok. Sup, dude? Sorry, I'm on my way to the store. Junpei is left. Oh, we have something we have to pick up tomorrow from somebody. Okonomiyaki. <laughs> Why are you making me hungry? Why are you making me feel this despair? Ch 
Jonah. <laughs> hey, Zach. Really? To me it sounds weird. But at least you find it catchy. Oh, my teacher told me about Mitsuru Kirijo, the student... She's going overseas after she graduates. Probably so she can run the Kirijo company later. She's so lucky she has the money to study overseas. Ooh, an Aki emote. Yeah, perhaps. I definitely want the Rise Derp, though. We should start making a list of these things. And Zach, yeah, apparently, though I keep telling them that the name Aki is within Chiaki, so you might as well do that, but I don't know. Wow, that's crazy. She's so different from us. The funny thing is, I hear she still lives in the dorms. I wonder why. Maybe her parents were strict when she was growing up. <laughs> The love triangle. Mind if I oh. interrupt? I was just told by the chairman that he'll be stopping by this evening. When you get back, come to the fourth floor meeting room. Oh, um, okay. Uh. I'll see you all later. I don't want to. Curious about what she meant. You decided to go straight home with Yukari. No! Hey, you forgot Alistair. You can't say Cullen without saying Alistair. <laughs> Alistair and Cullen are my favorites. Koro-chan, give me your paw. <laughs> oh, he did it! What a smart dog. Oh, hi. Koro-chan, go say hi. You can do that, right? His name's Korumaru. I've seen him sitting by the steps of the shrine. Oh! This dog still goes on walks all by himself? Who invited this lady? Whoa! Korumaru's in the chat! <laughs> Zach, you probably forgot because there's too many to name. What do you mean? He used to belong to the priest of the Naganaki Shrine. Every afternoon, the two of them went this way for a walk. That explains it. Well, until the priest passed away. He passed away? Oh, you haven't heard the story? It was about six months ago. The priest was hit by a car while walking his dog. He didn't survive. Ever since then, that dog sits patiently by the sight of the accident. Is that an alpaca? It's so cute! And he goes for a walk every day, just like when his owner was still alive. Oh, shoot, I have to get going. My son will be back soon. No, but really, who invited this lady to our dog petting party? Oh, you're such a loyal dog. Good boy. Huh? What's wrong? Oh, nothing. Sorry. Wait, isn't the chairman coming today? Then we should go get ready. Yeah. See you later, Korochan. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I wanted to let you know how my research has been going. 
This concerns those shadows that have been appearing during full moons. I want you to listen closely. It might be hard to follow. Shadows can be divided into 12 categories according to their characteristics. This we've known for a while. It's like their class or order. Now, I've classified the special shadows we've seen so far and it's simply fascinating. Those four shadows belong to categories one through four in order of their appearance. They may have looked different than the more common ones, but the classification scheme still applies. Is that something we should be excited about? Oh, I get it. There's 12 in all. Eight we haven't seen yet. That's exactly right, Fuka. You're quite sharp. Oh, uh, okay, but what are they after? That's a good question. And that's what we haven't figured out yet. Their motive. They don't kill their prey. They feed on their minds. It can be considered predation. But is it really? Is there an underlying intent behind their behavior? The purpose of the shadows as a whole, that's what we need to consider. This is interesting, but no matter what, we still have to beat the rest of them. I agree. That's about all we can do at this point. Eight more, huh? Lucky us. According to the data, each one has been stronger than the last, so we better start training harder. We'll manage. We've got plenty of time. What about Tartarus? Why does it even exist? <sighs> Pieces are falling into place one by one. The shadows that appear when the moon is full. You wonder what their purpose is. Eight of them remain. You still have a long road ahead of you. Well, that's right. Okay, if no one's there tonight, we should go and rescue that person and then come back home. Let's check. Oh no, I needed something today. What was it? <laughs> oh no. Eh, I probably missed it now. No! Because, like, who else wears glasses? It would just be, like, Chihiro or something, right? No! Boo. I always forget about that stuff. Oh, there you are. We ran into a bit of a snag again. Some of the other investors decided to drop out. Since there are fewer investors, each person's profits will be even bigger. Do you mind investing a bit more? Just 10,000 yen more. That should be plenty. Four, four hundred dollars now. My foolish little apprentice. Have you not yet realized that you were being deceived? Everything I've said has, been, has clearly been suspicious. Oh, I know. Ignorance should be a crime. Sure, you have some positive qualities, but if you remain so naive, everyone will take advantage of you. I, I already knew. I actually gave you that money to start your social link, so, you know. Stick with me and I'll show you how to be a winner. Oh, you could do that, Monokuma. Monokuma. <laughs> Very well, young lady. If you insist, I'll give you my autograph. It's, a, it's always a pleasure to meet a fan. No, I don't need one. Oh, don't be silly. Never look a gift horse in the mouth. I'm sure you've seen the home shopping program called Tanaka's Amazing Commodities. Allow me to introduce myself. I don't care. I don't care. That's right, I'm Tanaka. Surely you've heard the name. I'm afraid I can't return the 40,000 yen you gave me, but I've autographed my business card for you. Hold on to that. It'll be worth a pretty penny. Toodaloo. Lame. 
That little brat. Doesn't she realize she's in the presence of a star? I should have charged her extra for a private autograph signing. I can hear you. Huh? What do you want? Quit disturbing me. Shoo! Shoo! Did you overhear me talking to myself? You'll forget it ever happened if you know what's good for you. I belong to a powerful ta talent agency. I'm practically a celebrity. I have an image to maintain. Don't even think about telling someone he took my money or he called me a little brat. Capiche? I'll tell everyone. <laughs> Very funny. You may be cute, but you're no comedian. Silly me, I've let you in on my secret, haven't I? <laughs> Don't tell anyone, okay? Please, I'll lick your shoes clean if you want me to. Huh? That's okay. That means you won't tell anyone, right? Promise? I'll make you swallow a thousand needles if you're lying. A verbal agreement is considered a contract, and I'll sue your pants off if you breach ours. I've got your adorable little face etched into my memory. He thinks I'm adorable? <laughs> ah. That's too funny. His personality is kind of scary, though. Like, he, imme he immediately... I don't know if he is being sarcastic, but he just switched to, like, Oh, like your boots. guys are getting all deep in the chat there. But to tell you the truth, you might shine with a little polishing. I sense that you're something more of your average pretty- more than your average pretty girl. What you need in this world is brains. I already got enough of those. Without brains, you can't climb to the top. I usually take my breaks here. I'd be happy to mold your young mind whenever you wish. Okay. Wah! So scary. Why are you so scary? Who is it? Aki? Uh. Let's go hang out with. with Fuka. Mitsu tasted wonderful. It had just the right amount of sweetness to put a smile on my face. I felt... I felt wonderful for a while. I felt wonderful for a while? What? About Amitsu's black color. Do you think they use charcoal to color it? It's the soy sauce. Soy sauce? But wouldn't it taste saltier if you put that much soy sauce in for coloring? No, it's gotta be charcoal. Let's try making some next time, Chiaki-chan. Oh god. Why would I give her truffles when we made truffles together?
Kotomaru is such a loyal dog, and he's cute too. I wish I was a dog so I could get girls' attention. Don't you think Akihiko-senpai would look good with a dog? Not an unusual one, just an ordinary playful dog. Yeah, that's true. I could see them running on the beach together. Stop imagining my boyfriend. <laughs> just in general. Stop it. No, but really. That would be cute. Ugh, this would have been the perfect day to go to Tartarus and rescue that person. But no. Hey, Chiaki, I was thinking. The night before last, the Twelve Shadows, Tartarus, isn't there just too much we don't understand? Yeah, definitely. It's starting to get to me. countries don't serve octopus because they're feared as devilfish. My darling, for example, won't touch octopus. Last time I made pasta for him. But octopi aren't the only undersea creatures that are called devilfish. Now, here's a question for Junpei. Of manta rays, squid, and jellyfish, which of these is not known as a devilfish? I didn't even know octopi were devilfish. How am I supposed to know this? Hey, Chiaki, what do, you, what do I say? Uh, jellyfish. Good going, Junpei. Jellyfish aren't devilfish because they've, they're a dessert. Jelly, get it? It was just a joke. Ha <laughs> just plain common sense, Mrs. T. Thanks, Chiaki. I almost look like an idiot. Twitch. Oh, I didn't even know. This way, officer. By the time I realized the door was halfway open, his room was already in this state. I've left the place untouched as you requested.
Hmm. Whose room is this? Junpei Iori, a junior. I've been attempting to reach him on his cell phone, but he hasn't responded in the last 30 minutes. It was careless of me to let my guard down. This dorm has been attacked in the past. Security is everyone's concern, but if anything happens to him, it's ultimately my responsibility. I hate to say it, Miss Kirijo, but this is most likely... Huh? Mitsuru-senpai? What the hell? Kurosawa-san? What's going on here? Iori? Where were you? I've been trying to contact you. Huh? Oh, uh, it was hot. The AC was bust, so I went to the manga cafe and fell asleep. Well, I'm just glad you're safe. But if it wasn't an attack, then it must have been theft. Why would the burglar target this room? Theft? What else could it be? Someone clearly tore through the room looking for something. Vandalizing a school dorm. When I find out who did this, I'll see to it that he or she is executed. Well, son, sounds like you've got a death sentence. How about it, Iori? Was this room in fact vandalized? Uh, well, my room always looks like this. W what? B but You can't possibly live here in this state, can you? A and the door was open. Oh, right. I wanted to air the place out while I was gone. No one we don't know ever comes around, so... I think this case is closed. May I return to my duties, Miss Kiri Jo? Oh, uh, yes. I'm sorry you had to see something so disgraceful. I apologize for all this. It seems my upbringing may have been more sheltered than I realized. or something? What's the deal with you calling the police over a messy room anyway? What did I do to deserve this? Hey, wait. That fortune I drew on the way back, it was worst luck. rescue mission, so... <laughs> Alright. Let's go! Uh, between 44 and 47. Ah. Please 
spread out and search the area. I... All right, I'll keep looking around. Arm spaghetti. <laughs> And no, once was for the, the access point, and the other one was for the stairs, though it did look like he bothered me twice for it. Please spread out and search the area. Go be free. Ugh, I've been seen. I'll have to eradicate it. Kill it. There's one enemy. Let's go. I've been waiting for this. Okay, now. We just fell in no time. No tangling. Hit you in a spot. Oh, Back that way. Who did it? Aki, why? Please spread out and search the area. Hey, there's some cash in here. Oh, it's only money. Only money. Eh. Why? Please spread out and search the area. I just found something. I'll give it to you later. Okay. Stairs. Find that stairs. No. Very well. Yes. Ooh, nice. We on 44, but there's no one here. Okay. Please spread out and search the area. It's gonna be on one of these floors. Of on course. This floor. Find them, please. Had to be the pitch black floor. Oh! <laughs> Super lucky! I don't really want to. Is that the only person that was stuck? Who could I get a Christmas star from? Okay, let's go home. Oh. Uh huh? How the heck did I? Good evening. Are you surprised? It's hippie Jesus. Truth be told, we all visit this world every night. What are you saying? Who the hell are you? Is that you, Yosuke? Darkness reminds me of soy sauce. Didn't mommy teach you any manners? You haven't introduced yourself. Which means... 
He's also Minato, but he's also Little Pharaohs. <laughs> he's a lot of people. Good old Yuri Lowenthal. Take a look. Name, address, age, etc. This is you, right? Where did you get this? Somebody's got a grudge against you, and they asked us to get revenge. Revenge? What kind of bullshit is this? Revenge. Who put you up to this? Can't tell you. We're professionals. Professionals? Oh shit. You mean the rumors on the net are true? <sighs> May we get this over with now? Hey, w wait, wait, I haven't done anything! Why me? What did I do? That is not our concern. <laughs> Your notion of right and wrong is irrelevant. My client's wishes are all Oh, it is Makoto Yuki. I apologize. I'm so used to calling him Minato. I'm sorry. People hear what they choose to hear and believe what they want to believe. No! Stay away! Get away from me! You squeal most magnificently. Such raw emotion. He's not dead. Doesn't matter. We've held up our end of the bargain. Besides, to